Hello everyone, it's Alex, aka FlipsyCat, and welcome back to another Hypixel Skyblock video. So today, I am here on my island, and I'm going to be showing you how to build a cactus farm in Hypixel Skyblock. So yeah, be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you get notified when I next upload. I upload Hypixel Skyblock videos every day, so yeah. Let's go ahead and jump right into it. Okay, so here is my cactus farm here. If, as you can see, I have cactus literally flowing into it right now, and I have a bunch of cactus in here already. So yeah, I'm gonna be showing you how to build this, essentially. Okay, so I do recommend having magical mushroom soup for this, as it's gonna make things a whole lot easier. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna want to do is set up a eight block long two by two bridge like this. And then at the end and sides of it, just build a wall, one block higher than the bridge itself. Next step is to grab yourself some buckets and grab some water, and then just place the water at the ends of this bridge, and it'll flow right down to the very end. And then as you can see, this flows perfectly into the rest of my cactus farm, and this works by itself as well. Now then what you want to do is build eight blocks out from this wall here, on either side of your bridge and do this all the way up to the end. Okay, there you go. Now you should have two platforms off to either side of your bridge, just like this. Next step is to build up one block around the edges of these platforms. So now you have a wall walling everything off. And the next step you want to do is fill this with water. And make sure to place it on the sides here and it should flow straight into this. Okay, so that's one half done. Your water should be looking like this right now, and then time to do the other half. Okay, there we have it, that is all the water filled in. Now this is what your cactus farm should be looking like right about at this point. So now then, it is time to actually put in the cactus. So to do this, you're gonna need three items. You're gonna need cactus, you're gonna need sand, and you're gonna need strength. Now, if you don't know how to get sand, I posted a video on that a little while ago, so be sure to check that out. Okay, so now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to place blocks of wood, or any block actually, uh, every other block in your cactus farm. This has to be done in row form, otherwise if you do it in diagonal form, like this, the cactus will actually land on top of each other and just delete themselves. Okay, there we are. I have every block of wood laid out in this grid pattern. And next step is to put a block of sand on top of each of them. Okay, so now that you have all your sand laid down, the next step is to cover that sand with cactus. Place a cactus on every single block. Okay, there you are. All the cactus is placed down, but you're not done yet. You have one final step. So now what you need to do you need to p place a piece of string between every single cactus. And once again, make sure you do it inside of these rows, not outside. So don't place it here. And also you can place string on the outside here as long as it is over the water. Okay, there we go. All, all the string is placed down. It's hard to see, but it is. And then the final step as you getting your cactus farm up and running is place sand on top of that string. Now what this is doing is when this cactus grows, it will run into the sand and then it will break and fall into the water and it will get pushed down. Uh, now the whole point of using sand here is that you can always put more cactus on top of the sand and then go ahead and rinse and repeat the process with more cactus and then with placing string between the cactus and more sand and more cactus and string and cactus and sand and yeah. And there we have it. This is one layer of the cactus farm complete. Now, now all the cactus will flow down into the water. Now you just have one final step, which is to put in hoppers. That's self-explanatory. So at the end of the water flow, you're going to want to place down two hoppers. You're going to want to place down hoppers and then have them flow into a chest. Uh, you might actually want to place down an extra pair of hoppers because what you can do then is add two extra water flows out on the end here flowing into these hoppers and this means that the cactus farm is just a little bit more efficient as any cactus that falls here will fall into the water instead of on the side. So yeah guys that is going to wrap up this video. Thank you all so much for watching. I really hope you did enjoy. Uh, if you did be sure to leave a like and subscribe. I would very much appreciate it. 
and yeah, I will see you all next time. Goodbye.